and welcome to Frightfully Forgotten, and we've hit a milestone. 4,000 subscribers. 4K? Shit. And we're gonna celebrate. Yeah. With a beer. What are we drinking? Uh, Cascade Amber IPA. Mmm. Ah. We're celebrating a couple of things here. 4K subscribers, actually more than 4K now that we're shooting this, it's gone yeah. past that, which is nice. Yeah. Um, we're celebrating a package coming up in the mail. Yeah. And we're celebrating the new movie room, which we're shooting in right now. Finally got to move into a new fucking house. <laughs> so we're gonna christen the new movie room with a new Tombstone. Yeah. Dave Vanderhoff, who sent us a tombstone last year, it was a surprise. Mm -hmm. was we a thought we thought it was a bomb. Yeah. <laughs> Actually thought it could be something like that. <laughs> so this isn't a surprise. He told us he's going to send us another tombstone for the new room. Now there's two tombstones. Yeah. We don't have to carry one back and forth all the time. <laughs> so let's take a look at this tombstone. All right. Uh, oh, where's that damn? You got it? Oh, okay. I can do this one. So as Justin's opening this, you may notice there's a little echoey in here because we're actually shooting in an empty room. Yeah. Besides what's behind us, it's almost completely empty. I tried to put some boxes in here to try to absorb the sound a bit, but... The house is still empty. This is like the first thing we're doing here. <laughs> yeah, it's very weird. Actually. Literally shooting in an empty house. Okay. I'll hold the box. Oh. Okay. Ooh. So I know it's going to be a little different than our first one by a bit. Slightly different, different text, different font. Yeah. It's our font. <laughs> it's still just as nice. There we go. Thank you, Mr. Dave Vanderhoff. Excellent. Thank you very much. And he is a big fan of the IPAs. Oh, yeah. That's so, awesome. Cheers to Dave. Everyone, if you're drinking a beer, cheers to Dave Vanderhoff <laughs> for sending this to us. Yeah. Um, should also let you guys know that uh, we're going to put this now. Kind of like that. Oh, that works, eh? <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> Dave Vanderhoff is also one of our patrons on Patreon, too, so it's not something we do too often is push out the Patreon page because we're not really in it to make all this money or anything. Yeah. But if you do want to support the channel, um, that's where you guys should do it. Of course, ad revenue off of YouTube is like almost next to nothing, so if you do <laughs> want to support a YouTube channel, uh, especially ours, that's the best place to do it. The link is always in the description of every video. Yeah. And uh, if you join us, we're uh, right now we're basically reviewing movies that are requested by our patrons. So if you want us to review a movie, get in there, get in line. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we've got a lot more things coming up for um, the rest of this year and next year. We got uh, a lot more reviews. We got Halloween coming up. We've got music videos coming up. <laughs> Yeah, we actually have quite a full <laughs> plate. It's a little daunting, actually, like thinking, oh, fuck, like, winter's coming. And that, that puts a damper on some things because yeah. there's certain things, like, you can't shoot in the winter if you want to shoot. You know, we don't have no green screen. And even if we did, we're not green screen people. It's like, <laughs> yeah. uh, certain things you have to shoot outside during the right time of year. And uh, the, the window of opportunity has ended for some things, but that'll mm -hmm. give us some chance to hunker down and do some other things in the winter. That's like right. Like the music videos we have planned. Yep. And uh, we do have some specials for Halloween planned. We've already shot some of them, actually. Mm -hmm. This movie was super hyped up. I remember, like, the commercials, they were hyping back Jamie Lee Curtis coming back, reprising her role as Laurie Strode, pitting the two against each other, right? The final battle. Yep. And we've come a long way from our humble beginnings all the way up to now. Like, what, how long has it been? Seven years? Yeah, well, it's <laughs> coming on seven. <laughs> this is our seventh season, so we're working on our seventh year. That's a long time. And uh, you can tell the quality of everything has gone up, right? Yeah. From day one to now. It's like, you watch those early videos, it's like, 
Ugh, it's kind of <laughs> uncomfortable to watch them, actually. Like Some of them, yeah. <laughs> you definitely can tell where we hit our stride. And, uh, you know, we talk about this sometimes, with how like we seem to be struggling with the subscribers and stuff like that. Like, you know, some channels have started way after us, has all these tons of subscribers, and we're still, like, clawing our way yeah. up to 5,000 or more. And it's like... In retrospect, I hate to say, you look at some of those early videos and like, fuck, if we just would have, like, spent the money on some better equipment earlier on and stuff like that, that may have helped the cause, but you can't go back in time and change it. All you can do yeah. is learn from what you did before. But I think all it would have changed is the look. Like, I mean, the, you know, the content and how we would have done things would have stayed the same back then. Right, I mean, yeah. We've evolved in more than just the look. Right, yeah, exactly. It's definitely more, we're more comfortable now mm. than we were before, and we're less hesitant to say certain things. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, I think we, when we started off, we're a little kind of, not PG, but we didn't really speak our mind about certain things with fear that you'll get hate and shit like that. It's like, ah, yeah. fuck, just, you know, whatever. As long as you're not hurting anyone's feelings and you're being respectful and you're not being a complete douchebag. Yeah. You know, whatever. Yeah. We're also scared of using video clips for fear of copyright and you know, that kind of made the, the videos look kind of funny because they're just used still images and eventually you realize, wow, fuck, everyone else is using the actual footage, just use yeah. it, you know? Yeah. And we yeah. haven't been hit with barely any copyright strikes at all. Yeah. Um, considering that we, how many episodes we've done, that's pretty crazy. Yeah, that's right. And we have done a lot of episodes. Like, when you look at the number, it's staggering actually and there's so many reviews we've done where it's like, I can't remember, I can't actually remember half of them, to be honest. Like, we did that movie? Oh, fuck, okay. Like, I just gotta take your word for it most yeah. of the time. It's like, all right, fine. Then. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff in our back catalog, which it's, it's one of those things, like, it, it's there and sometimes you want to redo it, but mm -hmm. you don't want to pull a George Lucas and start redoing <laughs> everything, right? But yeah. We, we did do a re-edit of our uh, Top 10 Loomis Moments video, but that was more so because that video was getting a lot of views. And it was like, man, it's just not up to par to what we do now. An edit of that might be warranted. Right, yeah. yeah. So thank you very much for all the support you've given us. We've made it to 4,000 subscribers, and here's to another 4,000 more and beyond, I hope. Hopefully. It's, <laughs> it, it, we did, you know, it took us a long time to get to 1,000. Yeah. And then 1,000 to 3,000 took a long time too, but... 3,000 to 4,000 actually came pretty quick. And I think right. maybe at some point things start snowballing. I don't know. There has been noticeable growth this year mm -hmm. that's substantially more than other years. So what that means, I don't know. Maybe it's the naked women on the thumbnails yeah. and shit. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah, there's little <laughs> tricks you learn, right? Like, you hate to be shallow. Yeah, boy, you told me the stream was shallow. <laughs> But, you know, it's, sometimes you have to do certain things to get people to watch a video, right? And I hate to use the term clickbait, but, you know, having a good-looking woman on your thumbnail, well, you can't deny the numbers. Yeah. It, it gets views, right? <laughs> we don't do it all the time, no, so... No, no, no. You know. Sometimes when it's warranted, you know... Yeah. You know, sometimes, just, you know, if a movie's got a sexy woman on it, She's use there it. for a reason yeah. in the movie. You might as well use that to your advantage, right? Stay tuned for the Halloween season. We're looking forward to it. We got a few pretty good videos planned, a couple of surprises. Then in November, we're doing a whole bunch of videos where you'll see our deliverance spoofs oh. make an appearance to tell a grand <laughs> story. So we're going to have to try to force you guys to watch all of them in a row yeah. to get the story we're telling throughout those four videos. Yeah, so that'll be a lot of fun. And then it's going to be Christmas time and we'll be shoveling our asses off here in Winnipeg. Ugh, fuck. And I'll see whether or not I have to buy a snowblower or not. Nah, you'll be okay. I don't think I want to buy one. Thanks for watching. Yep. See you next week. And until then, keep drinking.